Welcome back, everybody. It is Fan Friday time. Guys, on the Patreon, we had you guys put in some uh, suggestions of what videos you guys want me to check out next. Uh, for a little bit, I thought about canceling it completely, but I decided, you know what, forget it. Let's keep it. Let's keep doing this. It's fun. I think you guys like it. I like it. And uh, yeah, why not? So uh, if you want, go and check out the Patreon. It's linked right down below if you want to get in on being able to vote. And also, give me suggestions for the uh, said vote. Uh, you can do so all over there. You can do it on the lowest tier as well, so you don't have to pay much money at all. And uh, also, there's a bunch of other cool content over there, so go check it out. And uh, yeah, before we get into it, guys, this, this, this video was one that uh, I put in at the very bottom of the poll and said, Mike, show us something that you like. Show us a song you like. I didn't think you guys were going to pick that. <laughs> I didn't think you guys were going to pick it, to be honest. And uh, it kind of threw me through, through a little bit of a loop where I'm like, shoot, I don't know what songs I want you to uh, hear. So I kind of dropped it down to two songs, which uh, one of them was going to be a song by a band called Under Oath. It is not the one that I picked for today. Uh, I was actually going to pick that or even possibly I was even considering doing Avenge Sevenfold. Because both Under Oath and Avenged Sevenfold were kind of my gateway into the hardcore scene. So I was either going to do Beast and the Harlot from uh, Avenged Sevenfold or Writing on the Walls by Under Oath. Those are the two I was thinking about off the rip. But then I was like, well, you guys know I'm a bit of a metalhead. You guys know I like that music. But I do also like a lot of alternative rock as well. So I was like, maybe I change it up. Maybe I show you something different. So these guys have been one of my favorite bands for a very long time. They're called Mute Math. They uh, unfortunately are no longer putting music out. They have broken up as a band. Uh, I did get very lucky. I got to go see them live in Brooklyn. Uh, shit, I don't even know how many years ago it was. It's got to be six, seven years ago at this point and uh they were awesome they were so good they're very very good and uh i picked one of my favorite songs by them it's not one of their mainstream songs either so this one is definitely a lot more niche um it's also a little bit of a sad song too a little bit sad so i have a live video of it i might do a lyric video of it as well just so you guys can ah no it's in english it'll be fine you guys for the most part most people here speak english so i think we'll be okay but uh, I do highly recommend it if you uh, want to hear this song on your own. Go check it out. It's a song called Clipping. It's by Mute Math. And uh, I love it. So I do have a live performance video that we're going to check out from him. Uh, video's 12 years old. So they, uh, like I said, they've been doing this for a while. It's been awesome. And uh, they, they, for a very long time, they were in my, uh, they're always in my top five on spotify year wrapped last year was the very first time they were not on there and that's because they stopped putting out new music so it kind of hurt my heart a little bit when i was doing my uh spotify wrapped and not seeing their name up there so i love these guys i think you guys might as well uh this song like i said it's more of like a b-side track uh comparatively to like how they talk about it in the uh, k-pop stuff but uh hopefully you guys actually give it an opportunity Otherwise, uh, I don't know what to say. So, without further ado, here we go. So, reminder, it is a 12-year-old video, so the quality is not great. But the audio is good. I checked it out before. Thank you. 
Ah, <laughs> uh, it's such a good song, but it's also a sad song. It's a bit sad about being overwhelmed, feeling like you need to give up. Such a good song. So their drummer, so good, so good. It's also a repetitive song on purpose. overwhelming feeling of being lost, being confused, lack of direction, you know, who do I blame, who do I fight, I don't know. So dope. Ah. Very refreshing and also feels very weird. Feels very weird to like listen to, you know, quote unquote, like my type, my music on the channel. Um, but yeah, no, I, I picked that song, you know, kind of ironically. I mean, if you watched all my videos this week, um, a lot of the videos actually really hit home with me. Uh, and in a very unexpected way. And I literally picked this video because of how it hits me where I do get overwhelmed. You know, I do get overwhelmed. I do uh, feel lost at points. I do feel like I just don't know what to do anymore. You know, like I feel like I'm fighting and fighting and fighting sometimes. And, you know, it's like I've almost feel like sometimes I've completely lost what I'm fighting for. Where I'm like, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. You know, and it's like, I mean, to be honest with you, that song always brought me in just sheerly for the musicality of the song. Like, I, I always enjoyed the way the sound of the song sounded. And then, like, looking into the lyrics and stuff, you're like, oh, man, like, actually, I hit, like, the lyrics hit me really hard as well, you know? And I, uh, I don't know. I thought it'd be a cool song for you guys all to get a chance to hear and, and check out. And, Gives you a little bit of a glimpse into my my world as well, and 
Um, I don't know if there's if you guys want me to do more of uh, you know my personal choices, I can do that. Maybe I'll put it on the uh, the on the uh, the the Fan Friday poll like once a month or something. And if you guys are feeling it, you guys are feeling it. And if you're not, you're not. You know, uh, not a big deal to me. But uh, yeah, I will say this though: our list on the Patreon right now is quite low. Uh, we definitely need some more recommendations. So if you have a chance, head over to the Patreon, join up, and uh, throw me some recommendations because uh, I think right now I have like four for next week. So uh, before the end of the weekend, if I can find out, that'd be great. <laughs> Let me know. Let me know, all right? So uh, thank you very much, and we'll catch you next time. Look at these guys. Ooh. Thanks for supporting. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what else to do. Thanks, guys. And thank you. Bye.